We are the keepers of the flame, the sacred order. Let the ceremony begin. On today, Faith Black Lights, we take a look at this. And what this is, as you can see here from Burger King, this is, so these are the fiery buffalo nuggets. And we have here the fiery buffalo wrap. So you can see there's a tender in there, I believe. Now, I wasn't sure how they were doing this, if it was just the fiery nuggets and they were adding buffalo sauce, or if it came this way with it baked in. So that will be one of the things we're gonna try to discover here, as well as to see if they've added any heat to it. If you are interested in the fiery nuggets or the fiery big fish, I have done those. You can check out the Restaurants and fast food playlist, and that's where those videos are. If you're curious about my take on that, but uh, let's uh, let's start with one of the nuggets and just kind of get on into these. Mm. So. Hmm. I don't know if this works. One of the th uh. hmm. One of the things I liked about the fiery was that they had this nice bit of sweetness to them, <clears throat> and that part is kind of gone here. I shouldn't say it's gone. It's just. This is not a very good um, sauce. This buffalo component, not very good. No real heat to speak of. Comes as an comes as an A piece. Why? Why this and why now? I don't. Alright. So flavor wise, they've taken a different downturn from the um, regular fiery, and heat wise, they're about the same. Taste wise, so this this puny little thing here and I got two of them is this is three bucks this is the the wrap and I don't know what all is on this is it is there a ranch or mayo or something on this no it looks like just the buffalo sauce itself look at how thin this chicken is Man, this is I wonder if they um so this is kind of a, a buttery buffalo sauce. That's on this wrap. Why are these so look at look how thin this is? I mean, you know, I will say that I do appreciate Burger King still trying to fly the flag of 
for, you know, so-called spicy chili, whatever. Because we really haven't had a lot of other restaurants doing it so far this year. They've done a few, you know, the ghost whoppers. They've done this, this fiery business here. I do appreciate that, that they're making the effort. Results I don't think are very good here though. All right, so the regular, the regular nuggets, regular fire nuggets were pretty solid. Oh, my goodness, oh. I can get kind of a cross section, this one came apart. See how thin that chicken is? And this is just, by the way, a regular chicken tender. It might be a spicy, or it's half. They're doing the same thing that Wendy's did. They're just cutting it in half. Boy, they really skimped on this sauce too. So, this one, we don't even have the breading on it. So, so this, what the hell, Burger King? <laughs> what, what the hell, Burger King? All right, so, I don't have a whole lot of Louisiana style cayenne sauces open at the moment, which is essentially what Buffalo is. But I did get this fairly recently from up at uh, Burn Your Tongue. My man Roger had this on his shelf. And uh, I have done another sauce from them. This one, you, there will be a video coming on. This is the colorful Colorado Creations Colorado Red Extreme Hot Sauce. And this is more or less in that sort of vein of Louisiana style buffalo, that whole thing. So we're just going to, and, and this is, um, we're at least going to be able to add the fiery before I get too far, I got to see what that does. Here, we'll just throw a couple on here. It's not quite as runny as uh, those sauces tend to get, but uh, definitely this is a very, very punchy sauce. Almost surprisingly so. But we're not talking about that for this review. We're just going to throw it on and see what we do. All right, so here it is on the uh, Nuggies. <clears throat> wow. <laughs> much hotter. Unfortunately, much more bitter as well, but we do have some fire in the fiery nuggets now. Man, this is... Look at this. Look, this is just completely falling. How am I supposed to eat like this? <clears throat> Burger King picks these tiny tortillas. These are what, maybe six inches? Very small diameter tortilla. This is stale. Burger King used to be my favorite fast food restaurant years and years and years ago. It really saddens me to see how far they've fallen. Oh man, this is... This, this sort of buttery buffalo sauce is not any good. I appreciate them thinking of us. Trying to get a little something spicy out there. But this isn't it. This is not any good. I, I can't recommend either one of these two things. <clears throat> the regular fiery nuggets I thought were okay. The chicken ones. 
I don't think that flavoring system worked very well on fish. I did think it was okay on the chicken nuggets. It was a bit one note, but it was it was fine. And um but man, trying to just add buffalo to it is no good. This is a really aggressively hot sauce. Particularly for this style. And, uh, yeah. It's one of the few that when it says on the label the sauce is hot, one of the few I kind of agree with. That's refreshing. Nice change. Okay, well, so by itself, it's not fiery. With that, it definitely is. Um, it's really interesting. They call both of these fiery buffalo, and the approaches are so radically different. Like, why wouldn't they make strips with that flavoring system? All right, so well, neither one of them were successful for me. I think the, the nuggets came off slightly better just because they're they're trying to cheat too much with the wraps. They do an abysmal job on their apps. Let's, let's be clear. Three bucks for that is a pretty much total non-starter. That is, that is not worthwhile to do. Uh, and I think all their apps are the same price. I, I wouldn't get any. If that's what they're doing with their apps, they're trying to just kind of plug the whole Wendy's thing or, or McDonald's or whatever they're trying to do. Uh, to me, that's a complete bust. So the wraps, I don't think I would bother with. Uh, the nuggets, if you really like the fiery nuggets, the regular ones, and you're interested in the sort of vague buffalo deviation, I, I guess you could get those. I mean, they're not very good, and they're not fiery, even slightly, unless you personally make them fiery, as we did here. Yeah, I mean, thank you for the effort, Burger King, but uh, unfortunately, I'm going to register this as another disappointment. In a uh, increasingly increasingly long line of them, unfortunately, I'm sorry to say. So uh, I guess we'll just leave it there. That was the entire fiery buffalo menu. Although that I make it sound sound bigger than it is, which is basically just the fiery buffalo nuggets and the fiery buffalo chicken wrap uh, from Burger King. But uh, there we have it. Now go four. In peace, to serve the flame.